Hi, it's Mike Lee. I'm at the Gower Show. It looks incredible today. The wind is blowing. I hope it's blowing the clouds away. This morning was a bit wet. It's wet underfoot, but everybody is having a great time here. Come on, let's go and have a look at the Gower Show 2016. I think it's the 99th show. I can hear the loudspeakers in the background. The cars here are just packed in. All the car parks are full out. So let's go and have a great day. We have been mentally and physically. And we've come up with the um, only use positive reinforcement with them as well. I'm Holly. Uh, so far, we've got a quiet show. Uh, it's going really well. Uh, hopefully, we won't get any major incidents today. It's a lovely day at the show in Gower. It's the first time for us to be here, but we've thoroughly enjoyed it so far. So I'm looking forward to a nice afternoon. It's our first time we've been judging the Hereford Cattle. We've been at it for 30 odd years, breeding Hereford Cattle. Oh, right. We've got a small herd and we were successful at the Royal Welsh Show this year, having the third prize of the class of seven, so we're very pleased. My name is Peter Sandra. I've lived in Gower all my life and I, I garden and I show vegetables at Gower show and local shows. And it's been a terrible year this year. There's no sun, there's nothing ripening, there's nothing growing properly. But some people grow in tunnels and they, they come off better in a tunnel and they do gardening outside. So how did you do this year? I've had a, a first with beetroot and three thirds. Uh, a third with beans, uh, I think for a minute, the longest bean, <laughs> and a run of beans. I'm uh, John Childs, I'm a, I'm a trustee and a, and a conservation uh, volunteer with Pentagare Trust. Uh, we have a woodland um, in a historic landscape. It's over 200 acres and it's within about two minutes of the M4, so it's very uh, very easy to find and to look around. We have a coffee shop and there's lots of lovely walks, including uh, a man-made waterfall uh, created by John Dilhan Duellen in the 19th century, um, still very popular with children today who seem to have difficulty in staying out of the water. <laughs> My name's Robin Kirby, Chairman of the Gower Society. Uh, that was founded in 1947 by people obviously concerned to protect the natural beauty of, of Gower. And indeed the Society was instrumental then in 1956 in Gower being designated an area of outstanding natural beauty, first in the UK. And of course it's the 60th anniversary of that now. So we've been very involved in, in, in Gower and the landscape of Gower, but we're also concerned with the communities in Gower. And we give grants. Last year we gave grants of about £75,000 for various projects in Gower, restoration projects and also activities carried out by the local communities. And we're sponsors of, of we're part sponsors with other people of, of the Gower show. That and how's we, that going? We to care, it's, 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 it's a very busy show and it's busy today, the weather's pretty good. Um, so, everyone, the tent is busy, people coming in and out, there's a good flow of people. What do you think of the show today? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> What's your name? Lowry. Uh, working for the Gower Brewery. Um, so I work for them normally in the week. So uh, because Chris does the bars here, we try and come down and promote all that stuff. It's a busy show today. It is, yes. <laughs> and there's a good range of beer here. There is, yeah. The best. <laughs> 
Gower Brewery started back in uh, 2011, a small microbrewery behind the Greyhound Inn. Uh, and over the last four, four and a half years now, we sold beers, uh, not just Gower, but beyond Gower, we've got a nationalist who is Carlsberg, a Welsh list in with Coors, and uh, you know, we've now had to expand. We're now in Crofty Industrial Estate, uh, gone to a new uh, brew plant, which is 20 brewers barrels. And yeah, it's literally four and a half years. I can't believe where we've got in the four and a half years. It's uh, really gone well. Uh, and we're just uh, today is uh, Gower Show. I've done the bar here now for a good few years. And uh, thank God it's dry, it's plenty of people about. And you know, it's a good Gower community show. You know, a lot of locals, a lot of people come in and see the, see the show. Well, I am PC Phil Davis and I'm the neighbourhood officer for the Ward of Gower. This is where the show is being held. It's a fantastic opportunity for us as local police officers to get out and meet some of those individuals that perhaps we don't get uh, a great chance to catch up with. It's a safe show. Make sure that you keep your valuables out of sight, lock your cars, lock your doors, and you'll be fine. My name's Andrew Brown. I'm the local uh, PCSO for Gower area. Um, as Phil said, it's uh, an ideal opportunity for us. We don't get to do it very often. Um, big show like this, all the local uh, residents and tourists. Uh, if there's one message I'd like to give at the moment, we would uh, experience a lot of rural crime in the area and this is our opportunity to get the message across, uh, keep your valuables and uh, equipment safe. And lock your doors. And lock your doors. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm Molly and this is Lola and today we're doing the dog show and we're going to win. <laughs> Aren't we Lola? Okay. And if you do have a catalogue on page 20, all the information is...